If you're expecting students to submit work in groups, then this video will show you how to link groups to assignments for group submissions. The groups and groupings you will use need to be set up before the assignment opens. See our videos Creating Groups in Moodle and Adding an Assignment for Online Submission if you need guidance in these initial setup procedures. For group submissions, all groups must be within an appropriate grouping. This grouping may already exist, and if so, this can be used. But you can equally create a new grouping with, for example, the name of the assignment in its title, and this is recommended for clarity and consistency. Once you've set up your groups and groupings and created your assignment, go to the following settings to link them together. Click Turn Editing On and scroll down to the section where the submission point for the assignment is. Click on the Edit button next to the submission point and select Edit Settings. Within Group Submission Settings, apply the following. Set Students Submit in Groups to Yes. Any student from a group can submit the work on behalf of the group. It is up to students to decide which group member will complete the submission process. In the event that the chosen person is not available, then another group member can submit instead. Set Require Group to Make Submission to Yes to specify that only students who have been allocated to one of the groups can submit work. A student who is not attached to any group will not be able to do so. Require All Group Members to Submit is set to No, so that after one member of a group has submitted the work, the other members will not need to take any further action. This setting cannot be changed. Grouping for Student Groups is where you select the grouping for your assignment, so that the correct groups will be used for this activity. Under Common Module Settings, set Group Mode to Separate Groups. This will add a filter to the grading table, which will allow you to switch between groups when grading student submissions. Make sure not to use visible groups, as if this is enabled, the students will see every group, not just their own, which is not advised. Click Save and Display to save and view your changes.